Central units for report of a wrong way northbound I-17. It can be one of the scariest and deadliest situations on the road. Vehicles heading the wrong way straight into oncoming traffic. 13 to 2, not stopping. Now Governor Ducey is planning to make a big investment, about $14 million to right the wrong way epidemic. The money will be spent on hiring more state troopers to work the night shift and to purchase 75 new thermal imaging cameras that can detect wrong way drivers. Ducey also plans on spending the money to beef up drunk driving patrols and investigations as the governor's budget and DPS chief Frank Milstead have linked wrong way driving to impairment. Most people think that these instances are overwhelming majority are substance abuse um, or have an impact of alcohol is, an, is a factor. Um, and the science shows that it's not necessarily the case. Capital Insider Marcus Del Artino referring to an Arizona family investigation back in October that found a majority of wrong way drivers stopped by police were, in fact, sober. That investigation found that since 2017, there were 130 crashes involving wrong way drivers. More than 60 percent of those drivers were impaired. But DPS also stopped another 483 wrong way drivers who didn't crash. Of those, 70 percent were sober. And that uh, Arizona family investigation also questioned if uh, poor road designs may be causing the high number of wrong way drivers. And I should also mention that as part of the governor's plan, there is another $60 million investment to upgrade our highways and freeways with new technology as well. Guys, back over to you.